Welcome to today's coffee break. Today's coffee break, uh, we'll be discussing a new feature that became available in Dynamics NAV 2017, and it is known as My Notifications. So let me just show you where that is. You can either go to the search and type it in, or you can go to Departments, Application Setup, Role Tailor Client, and it's down here under My Notifications. So let me show you what these look like. You have a few that are available here, and right now the default setting after you've done the installation of the NAV client is that they're all turned on. So let me show you how these work. We've got one here, uh, warn about unposted documents, and another one about their overdue balance. So let's go ahead and take a look at those, just to give you a feel for how they look. I'm gonna go back to my home, go to my customer, and we'll use the Canon group as an example. I'm just gonna create a new order for them. I'll press enter and immediately I get this customer has an overdue balance. If I click on the details, I see their outstanding balance, um, what their credit limit is, and I get an overview of their account. Let me go ahead and close that. And then I'm gonna go ahead and enter an item and we'll use the Athens desk, my favorite desk. There we go. And once I've, done, I've completed this order, I'm going to go ahead and release it. And then I'm gonna close out and I get this other message. This document has not been posted. Are you sure that you want to exit? So I'm going to click yes. So you can have order entry people that will never post a sales order. You know, they don't post the shipment, they don't post the invoice, and they will get this every time. And it's just one added step that's really unnecessary for them. So you might wanna turn off that notification for them. So let me just show you where we do that. So I click okay, or yes. We're gonna go back to the my notifications. And we want to go ahead and turn off warn about unposted documents because it doesn't make sense for this person. And these are personalized. So this is per workstation or per login. So this isn't that you're turning it off for everybody in the database. This is just for this user. The other thing I want to do is I'm going to go ahead and add a filter for the overdue balance. So let's say there's a certain dollar amount that I really don't care about. I can go ahead and create this filter. So what I do is I go to this conditions column. I'm gonna hover over the view filter details and you see the little line appears and I can click on that or I can press F4 on my keyboard and it will go into the conditions box. And I'm just gonna set a condition that says, I only wanna see people with a credit limit over $11,000. Click okay, click okay. And now when I go to the Canon group, who conveniently has a credit limit of $10,000, I'm gonna go ahead and show you how these changes affected the system. So again, I go to new document, sales order. I press enter. I no longer get that warning at the top. I'm gonna to go ahead and put in my Athens desk again. And I will release the order. And when I close out, it just closes out and I'm back at my customer card. I don't get that message popping up. So there's a little introduction into the notifications. Go ahead and play around with them, play around with the filters. Uh, you can always delete things, add them back, turn them off, turn them on. So you really can't do any harm uh, by testing them out. So I hope you've enjoyed this coffee break and the introduction to a new feature in 2017. Thanks for watching this Archer Point video. If you found it helpful, make sure to check out our website and blog at www.archerpoint.com. Additionally, if you have any questions regarding our products, services, or information in this video, feel free to email us at info at archerpoint.com. Thanks.